Hockey Wishbone. I'm Jason Barr. Welcome to Football Friday Night. Lucky Wishbone style. They've got the wings. Heck, sometimes we even wing it with all the last minute highlights and post game reaction coming in from our game of the week. Voted on by you, the viewer. And tonight, that is CDO at Amphi. Two schools off to a combined seven and one start. Two schools off to their best start in years. And the Dorados are unbeaten even without injured running back Stevie Rocker. He was supposed to be their star to freely field we go. The Panthers are three and one. The Dorados four and zero. Oh. Who would be cooking up a win tonight? It is CDO coming out strong. Montana Newstatter fakes and then takes it himself around the right side. That's a touchdown. I wonder if he was named after Joe Montana. Montana just getting started. I like saying that. This time a fake and he goes around the left side. Solid blocking and he's gone. But the knock on CDO is that all they could do is run it. They can't pass it, right? Wrong. Montana to Austin Brooks. Look at this bomb. CDO wins 36 to nothing. Here's some post game reaction for you. We're something special. We're doing great things out here. If we keep up the way we play defense and keep marching on offense like we've been doing, we'll be going far. Anytime you're five and zero. Oh. Um, and the support that we have at our school, administration, students, student government, all that. Uh, yeah, it's fun to, to travel this well on the road and hopefully uh, in the future we'll be traveling to some bigger, better places. Yeah, that schedule will get tougher for sure. Over at South Point, we are on Bijan Robinson watch. The Lancer running back needs 360 yards to break Kadeem Carey's record as Southern Arizona's all-time leading rusher. Think he can't do it tonight? Well, Bijan had over 400 yards in a game last week. The undefeated Lancers hosting Cactus. They're out of Glendale. We pick it up. South Point up 13 nothing first quarter. Even when Robinson doesn't have a big hole, tough yards. He's tough to bring down. All right, check out this pass from South Point later in the drive. That's quarterback Jackson Brolin to Lathan Ransom for the score. That made it 20 to nothing. And South Point goes on for the easy win, 54 to 8. We don't believe Bijan broke the rushing record tonight. Maybe next week when South Point is at Tucson High. Let's keep it moving now with the Buena Colts at the Desert View Jaguars. We pick this one up with it 7 0 Buena in the second quarter. Giovanni Borbin to Keon Taylor. And uh, he turns on the afterburner, and this is going to make it 14 0 Buena. Desert View, though, is going to need to answer. So, who's going to come up with a big play? How about Serge Gabria? Sorry if I missed that name there. Uh, that's a nice touchdown, but Buena wins this game. Uh, final score uh, the Colts take it 35 to 15. How about a 3 0 Pueblo team at Sunnyside? A little Southside matchup, first quarter, and it is going to be Sunnyside's Martin Arvizu. Martin, he's going to find his way into the end zone. This is going to make it 7 0 Sunnyside. More from the Blue Devils, more from Arvizu. Coming right at us. Another tough run. And this is going to set up uh, the Blue Devils in good position. It's going to make for uh, Dion uh, Conde to Jose Acosta for the touchdown. Uh, all sunny side, right? No! Wait, listen to this. Pueblo came back and won this game. 22-21. The Warriors stay unbeaten. They find a way to win. 22-21 Pueblo in that game. Hey, congratulations to the Bisbee Pumas. They went to Pima tonight and came away with an 18-12 overtime win. Bisbee is now a perfect 4-0 to start the season. Let's finish it off with Sienega at Rincon. The Bobcats are just one and two, but those losses were to tough Phoenix teams trying to take it out on the Rangers. Already up 21-7. This is Gabe Levy with a nice haul. He takes advantage to tack on six more. Good play on special teams here. David Wilkinson blocks the punt and recovers for Sienega. Bobcats uh, had their way tonight. They come up with a big win. Sienega takes it 63-7.